Om Shanti. Welcome to 21st of November's Godly Blessing. We are continuing with yesterday's blessing. God spoke about how your thoughts and your words together, if they are used properly and if they are in sync, then you don't have to serve very hard. That means you don't have to work very hard to maintain your relationships. You don't have to work very hard on people. You have to have a clean and clear inside. That means your thoughts and your words. Work on that and everything will be okay. On a similar basis, God says over here that may you be filled with the newness and speciality of serving with your combined thoughts and words and thereby perform magic, magic of thoughts and words. But before words, thoughts. The combination of thoughts and words works like magic. When you do this, all the trivial matters of a gathering will finish in such a way that you will think that it is a magic. So we generally get confused that I've been trying to say sorry to this person, but this person doesn't come back to me or I'm trying to make up my relationship with this person but this person doesn't trust me and the main reason behind that what God is saying is that your thoughts your feelings towards them are not clean and clear and even though you might be very sweet from outside but people can understand that you're not coming from the right place that means your words are not matching your intentions or your words are not matching your thoughts within or your words are not matching your feelings towards me so people then reject it so God says why do why do you want to work so hard the combination of thoughts and words ma- works words sorry works like magic when you do this all the trivial matters of a gathering will finish in such a way that you will think that it is magic then all the complications and trivial matters and who's right and who's wrong will all finish when your mind is busy in having pure feelings and blessings for everyone any upheaval of the mind will finish and you will never be disappointed in your efforts Efforts to what? Efforts to maintain relationships, efforts to maintain your business communication, efforts to maintain your relationship with your subordinates, efforts to maintain your anything which you think about or what is going on in your mind right now. You will never be afraid in a gathering. We are generally afraid to be in a gathering when we have dislike towards people. That means we are not able to think clearly and purely about them and we are like, mm, I don't, I'm feeling very awkward over here. Why? Because we have created that kind of conditioning of our feelings and our thoughts in such a manner that even if we are forced to go somewhere and if we don't have a good feeling or good wishes towards others we feel awkward and we feel afraid in a gathering that i hope this person doesn't get to know what i'm thinking about him by serving with your combined thoughts and words you will see an impact of such service at a fast speed now become full of this newness and speciality in serving the nine lakh subjects will easily become ready the secret of nine lakh subjects is revealed at Brahma Kumai Center after the seven day course. Do visit this center and understand what does it mean by nine lakh subjects. Who subjects and why? Om Shanti with this.